Hey guys, going to do a, a video here of a level 88 research garrison. Um, this right here, I'm going to be using one Zelos uh, to hit this target. Now this is after the uh, after the the latest upgrade where they have changed the 82s and the 88s. Um, so. When they changed them, one of the things they changed, guys, they, they made it to where you, you come in, no matter where you click on the, um, no matter where you click, you're going to come right in here at 11 o'clock. It doesn't matter what angle you hit that target at, you're always going to be positioned right here at 11 o'clock. Uh, now, this is a ballistic. This is a Zelos. It's got quake cannons on it, and I will add a link uh, to the build um, at the end of this video. Alright guys, the first thing I'm going to do, I, I'm going to do, I come down, I bring my boat right here. I come in between these two mines and this level of platforms. I come straight in right here. I'll go ahead and tell you, uh, let me stop this. When you kill that, uh, the only danger you come into is ships. And that's the, that's the weakness of this particular boat um, with the quake cannon on it is that ship damage is awful on the quake cannon, uh, but it does really good against buildings and structures. That, um, let's see, I've got two fa uh, Phalanx 4s, uh, one, ga uh, one Gale 2, one Gale 1, and eight quake cannons. When you kill that shipyard, uh, these boats come in from the left side of your screen, and they catch you, uh, they, they, they will kill you. Uh, so what we want to do is kill that shipyard when we're up in this area so that these boats when they come in they come down here and get destroyed okay it's the only boats you have to worry about coming you don't have to worry about the ones on the bottom at all so here i'll shut up and continue to drive here so i'm going to do anything i can to avoid that uh, shipyard and kill it Kill it last, or not last of the target, but last in this area. If you're careful with this, I usually do these uh, for zero damage. I'm just going to work. I'm going to make a U turn right there so I don't get that dock or that uh, shipyard. I'm going to come kind of right there. When I kill that, it'll splash that out. And now these turrets right here, if you don't move until it lands, you'll never receive any damage. When it fires, you gotta stop. And then inch up, and then you'll usually splash that out, okay? All right, once you stop firing, see these boats coming at the bottom? They're gonna come down here. And all those turrets will take care of that. I never hitting uh, hitting the target this way. You never have to fool with any boats coming in the target. <clears throat> I come around, come all the way down here uh, to the right hand side, killing these turrets on the way. Now don't don't skirt the edge of this. Don't don't get up at the edge of this. If you do, this turret's going to start firing at you. So stay in the middle of this channel and come down to about the center point of this opening. And you've got a another executioner you've got to kill right here. All right. Now what I'm going to do is if I could draw a line between these straight across this point, I'm going to bring, bring my boat right there. And I'm going to come directly at that cold snap. And I'm going to stop. Okay. I'm going to continue forward to this point and stop when this thing fires. Okay, it's going to land all around me, does no damage. Stop again because it fired, land all around me, and then just sit here and kill. And there we go. Now I'm going to continue to come to this point. If I turn this direction, these executions are going to fire at me. What I want to do is just keep coming to that point until I get to that cold snap. 
All right. Now this is a part that took me a little bit to learn. I used to come to this point right here. But as I would come to this point, it took me forever to inch around this platform because of this turret. Because once it fires, well, you've got to stop or you're going to receive damage. So if you come to the center point between this, this wall and this platform, just come to this center point right here. And when you get there, you can stop, kill that torpedo tower. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to click right in this area, and it's going to make my boat come up, but I'm going to stop it. I can't, you know, go past this point or this cold snap's going to fire at me. I want to stop, and when I do, it will splash this out. So really, I only have to stop one time. I don't have to inch forward, inch forward, inch forward. Now we're just going to stop when we get in range of these cold snaps and these other turrets and splash stuff out that we can splash out. And that's it, guys. That is a level 88 uh, garrison uh, FM target with one Zelos. Um, it looks like I took a little bit. Let's see how much damage I took. Zero seconds. I took zero seconds damage on this, okay? Um, very simple to do. You get about 9 million points. 9 million, 9.2 million. Uh, it would be a big grind uh, to get to tier 5, but it's doable. Especially if you're doing it completely free. Uh, let me get in here real quick. My base, and I will at least show you um, the build on this thing. So you can see, there it is. So, two fail fours, a Gale 2, a Gale 1, and the rest are Quake Cannons. I've got two M armors and two X on this thing. Don't think you have to have that. Like I say, I never got hit with anything, so I really probably need to strip these off and use them on other boats. Um, combustion System 2, Nuclear Accelerator, Seismic Rounds, which gives you the ballistic damage, projectile speed, and ballistic reload. I use Alloy Armor MX3 uh, and Garrison Battery MKX uh, for the added uh, building and wall damage, which that probably needs to be replaced. I probably need to just go with Siege Battery on that, so that can be something I refit with a Zelos token or two that I may have. All right, guys, um, I'll put a link to this build uh, on the Huggies. And I uh, hope it helps. Thanks, guys, for watching. Hey, Pirates. Thanks for watching today. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope it helped in some way. Uh, please subscribe to the YouTube channel, Brethren of the Coast. You can also join the Facebook group, Brethren of the Coast. Uh, also, look for lots of help on uh, Battle Pirates on Battle Vortex. Um, please uh, join that group as well. Thanks, guys, for watching.